It is Freedom First Friday, and today we're talking about another great organization that Freedom First works with, Big Brothers Big Sisters. Here to tell us more is Susan Larkin from Freedom First and Jessica Turley from Big Brothers Big Sisters. Welcome both of you to the show. Great to have you. Thank you. Susan, let's start with you. Tell us a little bit about Freedom First relationship with Big Brothers Big Sisters. Okay. Uh, I am in the community development group with Freedom First, and I work in community banking, which means I get to work with mainly nonprofits in the area. Big Brothers Big Sisters is definitely um, a nonprofit that is a favorite of mine. Uh, we, we are happy to uh, work with Big Brothers Big Sisters this year again. Um, on Over the Edge. Yes, which is coming up very soon. So let's talk a little bit, Jessica, about the mission of Big Brothers Big Sisters. Yeah, absolutely. So Big Brothers Big Sisters provides one-to-one -one mentoring relationships to children facing adversity here in Southwest Virginia. We serve kids from Roanoke all the way down through Pulaski, um, so we have a pretty big footprint. Mm -hmm. And uh, what sets us apart is that uh, these mentoring relationships, these one-to-one -one relationships, last for at least one year. So um, a child is meeting consistently with their big brother, their big sister, um, creating that uh, relationship that's built on trust. And um, in a lot of cases, those relationships at the one year mark continue on. Right, yes, they don't just stop. Exactly, they've, exactly. They've built a nice relationship right. together. And of course you have the Be a Big for a Day, which we've yes. both done, which is great. And of course the Over the Edge event is yes. coming up. And we have a little bit of uh, footage that we wanna share. Tell us a little bit about it if people are not familiar with Over the Edge. Over the Edge is an event where participants raise $1,000 and then they are able to repel from the roof of the Patrick Henry in downtown Roanoke. Uh huh. It's 132 feet. Um, sure, no big deal. Yeah, there, it's, there's it's, Lindsay and Jeff doing it <laughs> the, a couple years ago, right? Yes, yeah, it, and it's, it's a great event. It's a very unique and one of a kind opportunity to be able to repel. Um, you can see, you know, the whole city, you have a great view of Elmwood Park and the Star, and mm -hmm. um, so it's a, it's a unique view, it's a unique um, activity, you know, not many people, only people who have gone over the edge for us can look at that building and say, I've repelled from I've the roof of that, from of that, that building, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And good for you, yes. and I understand, Susan, uh, we're going for it, aren't we? That's right. No, I, I shouldn't say there. we, you. <laughs> I'll be I'll on be terra there. firma, okay? <laughs> May, May 20th, I'll be there bright and early. Okay, what made you want to do this? Um, I would say it's probably one thing on my bucket list. Okay. And I was probably the number three choice from the credit union. <laughs> So, <laughs> so you, I'm excited. <laughs> you are excited. Okay. So yeah, they t they tell us that the first the first part getting over that one initial like ledge is the hardest. But once you do that, you're good to go. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Yeah. But when they tell you to put all your weight on the rope, you're like, uh, I don't know <laughs> if I should do that. But uh, it's totally safe. Over the it edge is an organization is, that does this. Yes. Right? Yeah. It's over the edge is a professional organization that comes and does all the rigging and. Um, it's not Big Brothers Big Sisters staff holding ropes and being like, you can do it. It's uh, it's very safe. They mm -hmm. do all of the, they get you geared up. They do training. Um, so a lot goes into it before you're actually repelling. You're actually there for probably about an hour mm -hmm. getting ready and, and learning how to use all the equipment. So um, it's, a, it's a very professional experience. Um, and, and so it's you're in good hands, safe. Susan. Right, yeah. So, so they are telling me, yes, yes. <laughs> it's going to be great. Okay, so if people want more information, they want to do this. This, there's still time, right? Yes, yeah, we still have time. Mm -hmm. um, we have a couple spots left, very limited uh, amount of spots. If you go to bigslittles.org slash OTE, mm -hmm. you can register online and uh, get your fundraising page set up, which makes it really easy to raise the thousand. All right, raise that money and go over the edge and good luck, Susan. And if you want more information on Freedom First, there are several branches to serve your needs. Freedomfirstcu.com. They're also on Facebook, Twitter, all over social media, or give them a call on that a toll-free 1-800 number. Thank you, ladies, and good Thank luck you. on May 20th. Thank, Thank you. you.